Thank you and good evening. It was a bitter end for Jorge Garza after the jury found him guilty of conspiracy to possess and distribute over 2,000 pounds of marijuana. After a week of evidence, arguments and testimonies, the jury composed of 12 members arrived at the unanimous decision to find Jorge Garza, a former Hidalgo County Sheriff deputy, guilty for crimes on corruption which carries a sentence of anywhere from 10 years to life in prison. During the greater part of the morning, both sides presented final arguments in an effort to convince the jury, but it was the lawyers representing the U.S. government who succeeded. Their points being that Garza knew what he was getting into, doing favors for the former head of the sheriff's Crime Stoppers unit, J.P. Flores, by conducting bogus traffic stops to help seize or escort drugs to benefit drug traffickers Fernando Guerra Jr. and Sr., during deliberation by the jury, Fox News cameras followed Garza and asked for a response, but refused. Garza was the only one out of 12 members linked to the now disbanded Hidalgo County Panama Unit Task Force to plead not guilty and choose to go to trial. Before the verdict, Garza sighed, but showed no emotion after hearing the decision the jury made. Garza will return to federal court tomorrow afternoon for a special hearing where he plans to request a bond before his sentencing on October 17th. Reporting for Fox 2 News, I'm Oscar Margain. Back to you.